Hi everybody, welcome to Shri's in a Circle. I wanted to share uh, an update, a dream, it's a beautiful dream, because I feel like it's um, it's an awakening of some sort, this dream. <sighs> awakening of some sort. Love you. If you are listening to my videos, you're pretty special like me, you know. It's this stuff I share is not like mainstream stuff. Um, well, we're not mainstream, you know, <laughs> we're special. So this, this particular video is about this beautiful dream I had yesterday. And what I noticed is that the day before I was singing a lot of light language and I was listening to a lot of light language. And maybe, you never know, logical mind always wants to know, but the spiritual mind is like, let it all go. And probably it activated something. And in my dream, I was in an elevator that was really old, really old, um, very old school and in metal and heavy and like I was scared of it. But eventually a lady showed me how to open that elevator and pry open its bars, right? And then get into it. It's like this metallic mesh um, steel. Uh, get in there it's shaky and I'm kind of like oh my god but then I get into this wooden crate which is the lift um, but the 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 roof is open so broken open but for a good way the the lift uh, went down and I slammed down to the floor of the lift with the girl but it didn't matter because my eyes were looking up and the most extraordinary scene I saw the Milky Way it was so amazing just so amazing. The time of the sky was twilight in my dream. It was purplish pink and the Milky Way with all the stars was just extraordinary. And what was even more beautiful and captivating were this family of eels, electric eels that were swimming, I would say, but actually they're flying because it's, it's the space, right? It's the sky. And they were flying in the sky with their electric lights flashing and scintillating. It was the most beautiful vision I had. And uh, the time of the night was obviously I woke up, you know, it was six o'clock, so I must have dreamt this around five-ish. Um, you know, it's the time when I normally get my visions and my dreams and astral traveling. So there is very much a thinning of the veil that's happening and a remembrance of your galactic origins but the message is also showing like you know it's so important to ground yourself like to bring yourself close to earth so that you're grounded on earth but then remembering your galactic origins so i think a lot of us are waking up to fully comprehending and understanding our galactic origins it's quite confusing at first and that's why I feel like it's going to take me some time before I really get there because you know the lift was like heavy and opening and it was but I'll get there eventually and we all are and there is an amazing awakening that's happening right now it's an amazing shift that's happening right now in planet earth so don't get distracted by you know the daily human life it seems like the real deal the real stuff that really truly matters is elsewhere than our physical bodies. But we have our physical bodies, we have our families, we have our 3D life, but in parallel, there is a shift that's happening in your cosmic galactic soul level. If that makes any sense at all? Maybe not, but see, the logical mind cannot understand a lot of things. <laughs> it's quite limited. So anyways, um, keep singing light language, keep channeling and keep, you know, looking inwards and meditating because that is when we're really going to awaken into our divinity and know what our soul mission is to be. Just so much more than what society makes you think you are. You know, you are just so much more. And with that, peace.
this beautiful crystal as well is my friend right now and maybe helping me we've got friends all around us not always sentient beings like always sort of okay, live beings but even crystals are sentient beings with energy so they could be guiding you too never underestimate that your dog your cat you no know, they could be high masters right so yeah never underestimate um never assume and keep a very open heart and an open mind and with that beautiful love to all beings keep the faith keep meditating so much love